What's up, Wayne Barron here with Dark Effect Studios, and we are inside of Windows 10's IIS, and this is version 10. And I have up a video that shows you how to do the custom 404 arrow redirect pages. However, that has changed in IIS 10. Okay, let's take a look at something here. And IIS 7 is the version that I did my lesson on. You had to put the folder name right here, which this is my folder name, which is the knowledgeexchange.org. That's my folder name. So you had to have that in there. However, when you load the page, it gives you this error. But in Windows 7, it worked like a charm. So there's one thing that has to change in order to make this work is that you got to come in here. Instead of having folder name, you change it to the name that's over here, which is ask. So we're going to change that to ask. Click on OK. Then after we change that, we want to right click on the folder, come down to edit features and choose custom error pages. Click on OK. And then let's bring page back over and reload it. And there we go, the page loads, and now we got to go in and fix all this mess. Okay, Wayne Barron here with Dark Effect Studios with the new IIS 10 inside of Windows 10. And my cat is right behind my laptop. Y'all have a good one now. Bye-bye.